The community is coming together tonight to support an officer still in the hospital following Friday's shooting. And another officer and a police dog are now recovering at home. KBOI 2's Lauren Clark is live in Meridian to tell us about the vigil planned for this evening. The community pouring out support for two Boise police officers and a canine shot Friday. A candlelight vigil happening Tuesday night will offer prayers and well wishes to the officers still recovering. Candles will be provided as well as baskets to hold get well cards or pictures for each of the officers. You will also be welcome to sign a banner of support that will be hung at both the Boise Police Headquarters and the hospital. A donation jar for the Canine Association and the Fraternal Order of the Police will be there too. Coffee and hot chocolate will also be provided. And that vigil begins tonight at 6.30 at the Idaho Peace Officers Memorial in Meridian. KBY2 will have live coverage of the vigil on our Facebook page and KBY2.com. Meanwhile, Police Chief Bill Bones is asking children here in the Treasure Valley to make get well cards in order to decorate St. Al's hospital walls. They look a little bare. Bones says officers can come pick up those cards at schools or you can drop them off at the station. This is a great way you can help. He also asks cards be made for Corporal Chris Davis and K-9 Jardo, who were also shot and now recovering at home. And today, K-9 Jardo will be meeting with a veterinarian again as he continues to recover. Be sure to tune into KBOI 2 News at 4 and 5.30. We'll give you an update on his condition, plus show you the relationship between canines and their handlers. It took four doctors to save Jardo's life, along with two different blood donations from other dogs. Meet those little guys, Cricket and Miles. Nampa's fire chief is now charged with a 